Hey guys, and welcome back to my Luton Town YSL on FIFA 18. And in today's episode, we're going to be playing Stevenage first, and then we'll see how many games we get from there because my episodes are getting pretty long. Oh, I actually don't know because this is. Oh, is this is a rivalry game? Okay, I don't think I realized that. Alright, boys, get the ball. Come on. Oh, I fouled him there for no reason. That's a nice and early yellow card. Ah, I was hoping he wouldn't send that pass a word. I thought that one was in. I thought we were down 1-0 in the second minute. And that was going to be super hype, guys, if we went down 1-0 in the second minute. Let it run for a little bit. Oh, Sir Papambo. Sir Papambo plays so much. I just realized that. Well, I've realized it before, but like, it's played three games in a week now. Oh, Zamnov. Well, that's that's gonna end up in the corner. That's a really weird clearance, but okay. Hit it. Oh. Keep the pressure on. All right, Fultz, that's all you do. Nope, took it right into the defender, Bogdanov. Come on, man. Um, he just passed it straight to number 10, because Della had hit that. He's offside. Yep, I saw the flag go up, so we're good. That might have gone in, but I saw the flag go up, so suck it, Godin. Suck it. He's a good amount offside, I think, too. Oh, nope, in fact, I think he's onside. Okay, they didn't call it onside, so we're good. I'm not able to control the ball right now. Oh my god! Mm, that's gotta be a goal. It just does. He missed! Oh my god, he missed! Somehow he missed. He just toe punched it wide. Some oh no, he didn't toe punch it. That's absolute trash. And they're gonna score, aren't they? See, we just can't get the ball. We can hit him, then we just don't get the ball, and then Maximov's got a yellow. Oh. And so did Bojanov. Maximov and Bojanov just got themselves yellows, I'm pretty sure. Maybe, maybe somehow Bojanov got off without one, but, like, you'd have to assume he didn't. You saw the tackle. Mmm, this is gonna go in, isn't it? It's a little over, and yep, that's halftime, nil-nil. These guys are last. Like we should just be out all out dominating them. Alright. Alright. Are you special? Who was that? Delev. You've gotta be kidding me, dude. That's such a simple pass to complete now that they might score because of that. What a save. Thank you, Valet, for those very quick reaction times. Oh, and it all comes from just a completely garbage pass in the midfield. Oh, he tips that thing just wide. It still almost went in off the tip. God. No. No. Off the bar, but that one. Don't even let it get out for the ball now. And we're too slow to do anything with it! Make runs! Don't just... Oh, I'm gonna jog at the same place he is. Oh, it's pissing me off so much. Come on. What is this? This is garbage. Okay, one last chance for D. Okay, it's Jesus. Oh, of course! Of course we take one too many tot! Because that's just been our signature for this whole game. Call it. I, I would just... I could basically put out of our misery. And we're actually going to lose, aren't we? Thank you, Sala, for at least coming through there. So it's a tie, full time. Oh, uh, who's the player of the month? Who, who's that over there? I saw that it was one of our guys.
Why don't let me click on it? Is that not a thing anymore? Can you not click on it? Who is it? I don't know who that is by picture. So we have a lot of guys who look like that. Could that could be Piss Pass, Sale. I don't know who that is. It's Piss Pass. Okay, thank you. That's all I wanted to know. Because that could have been Piss Pass or Sale right there. And Sale had a decent month also. We haven't actually won a game on more than one goal, so I would like to come out and do that for once. That's our goal, is a two-goal win for today. Alright, alright, James. Put that away. There we go! 1-0! Alrighty, who was that? Saavedra? Probably. Yep, Saavedra. Yes, boys, we needed that. That honestly feels so good. There we go. Pretty good goal also. James took, went for a long run there. I thought I passed it too late. I thought he might have been offside. But he wasn't. And yay, he wasn't. Yep, he gets the keeper diving one way and just places it right in the bottom corner of the other side. Ruben Saavedra scores his fifth of the year. Play solid at the back now. Come on. Alright, Maximal, that's easy. That's, well, you're so much taller than him to put your head in there. Don't really know what just happened, but it rolled to valet, so it's alright. We're having trouble getting it out of the back. Auto. Circle palm ball. Zip for Vogel. Let's try it. It's not, I couldn't have hit through a ball there if it was quite a simple pass. It wouldn't have been that simple, it's to his feet to get it out of the back with the ball. Ooh, we got turned. Okay. Alright, alright. Let's try to get this to serve the fumble. Okay, Max Moth. Actually, now he's reading that, so. Okay, Savage. Still got it to him. And Vogel was too slow. Slow on the turn. Come on, man. Yeah, what's that? Why are you running away from it? Come on, Maximal. Oh, that's pitch pass. He ran in behind him in the end. And we just let him score. That is the worst goal we've conceded. I'm actually willing to say that now. Even with the one where piss pass went down against Geltman. Just because of awful defense. There's so many chances to not let this happen. And then every one, we're like, oh, it's fine. Right here, piss pass gets behind him. Doesn't chase him. Maximal doesn't even make the slightest bit of, bit of an effort to get the ball here. If he does, then that shot never happens. And you can't be mad at Valet for getting nutmeg there. He has so little time to react. He's just hoping that it somehow hits him. But what I'm more mad about is the fact that Maximov makes no effort to get it out. Shoot it. Oh, no. How'd the ball end up so high in the air? And we're behind! We're behind now! I love this so much. This is an absolutely dominating. The one game we dominate is the game we just get torn apart at the back. Just look at this. Maximov has got to play as. Oh my god. There's so much. There's so many things awful about that. Must be mentally handicapped. Still got it out wide. And just, just take it right into the defender, right? Smart. Very smart. Are you serious, guys? You've no sense of. You just have no awareness at all. Zero awareness. Okay, half time. Good. Our whole team should be shaking their heads. That was an awful performance, especially defensively. Let's look at the match facts. They had taken four shots and scored two goals. And had two shots on target. Why? I mean, think about both the goals they had. It's because we just let them take easy shots right in front of the net. So they outplayed us. Counter-attack, come on. 2-2, two two. there we go. I, we're getting the ball, though, because we're going for the win here. 
Thank you, Saavedra. You seem to be our only player who's worth anything anymore. But, oh yeah, of course, he's got zero potential on him. And that's because the keeper didn't go anywhere. He didn't travel with the ball whatsoever. It was an easy shot for Saavedra. I think we still have it. It's barely what we do. Yes! Yes, and Vogel is back! I wasn't sure about it, but you know what? That's why he gets to dab on the haters, man. Because I was a hater there for a second, man. I really was. I was a I was a Vogel hater for a second. But, you know, Lennart showed me why I shouldn't be hating on him. By burying the shot right there. Now let's play solid at the back, please. Be quite angry if we end up screwing ourselves into a draw there. But I know it's definitely still possible. We scored again! Okay. We might actually win by two goals also. If we can play solid at the back, we'll get our two goal win. Like I said, I wanted to at the beginning of the game. And Brown scored now, so... Everyone has been a striker for us this game is scoring. That's a decent goal, actually. Uh, that's left the middle wide open, to be honest. I don't know how decent of a goal that was. And the keepers don't come out on this game very often. I noticed that, too. That's why that shot wasn't very hard for him. I thought it went in. We won four to two though. It's official. We got it. We got to win by two goals. Is what I asked for. I thought we even had it at five two to the last second there. Good job, Luton. You fought till the end. Came out with a four to two win. That's how you do it. Spirit, I'm sitting this one because I want to actually play a real game. If we get knocked out, we get knocked out. Yep, we're out. All right. We, we went up in the first two minutes, let them tie it in the third, and then they won the game in the 87th. We had won that, but oh well. Okay, and there's the table. We are back on top with that win against Luton. It's a good thing we came in clutch there. Right Luton Town versus Exeter City at Kenilworth Road. Here we go. Also notice we're playing a lot of home games. The second half of the season is going to be filled with the way games. Not really what I want for the second half of the season. Ah, uh, you just got burned, circle ball, but you know that that pass completely got you. Nice to come in there, that was a good tackle. Doesn't have any options, so it's just headed into the middle. Put it away! Oh, Brown! No! Brown, that's gotta be in the bottom corner, dude. That could not have been more on a silver platter for you. Well, I guess I can think of one shot that was, right, Zamnov? I'm sure that was a few episodes ago, the Zamnov miss, so I don't know if you all got that. It's just the fact that that's the one I'm currently Offense. editing. It's so short for the most part. I can't think of one offender on my team who's a decent height. It's the only guy who's tall is Maximov, and he plays center back. That could have been a penalty if the ref was looking at it. It's still one. No, anyway, huh? Sure is. I just love it. How great, how we get the ball here. Look at this. He just touches it away and lets him get it right back. And I didn't tell Valet to come out that time. That was his decision. If he'd stayed in, we would have been fine, because he wouldn't have needed to go down to get that one that went right over him. Let's go to the ball. And it's right out of bounds. All right, that's half time. Yep. Are you joking, guys? Why can't you pass the ball? You're a center midfielder. If that's your specialty. Is being that's what you should be good at is passing it. And yet you're still absolute garbage at it. And we are down two nil. Uh, I don't understand. Let's end it early. Which makes so outplayed, it's ridiculous. 
Oh, it's gonna be a good guess. We're not even on the same level as these guys. How are we ever ahead of them in the lead? We must have seriously slipped up, or else this is. You've gotta be kidding me. That's just about our luck this game. Go forward, Nagatsuka. Don't mark up. Go. We need another guy forward. We're trying to score. Wasn't it 0 0 at halftime? No, it was 1 0. Okay. But it's actually 3 0. Like, we're getting. And that's 4. It's 4 0. It just is. Man, this. This sucks. Like, I had a bad day today altogether, kind of. Now it's come home to have an awful second of FIFA. We scored. At the very least, we scored. Took it out of the net. Oh wow, so we're losing by so much it doesn't even consider that an option. Or is he just mentally handicapped? Well, oh, there we go, we figured it out. Is that Saavedra? I think so. Yeah, it was Saavedra. These are really our only hope at this point, huh? Are you serious, guys? And then the fits. I'm not even as mad that we missed that. It's not a really easy shot. It's the fact that Vogel didn't make an attempt to get the ball there. So he could have possibly made it three to two on the rebound. I don't know. Like, is it did it, the injury mess with Vogel because he's not half as good as he was before this? Just call it. Three-one loss at home. Beautiful guys. Honestly, just beautiful. I didn't know we were this talented. Not gonna lie. I really was unaware that he had this much talent in us. So we lose three one at home. Ah, <sighs> what bothers me is like it's not like it's our complete B team either. Like that. that put Exeter on the top of the table. Of course it did. Because how much worse could that have possibly gone for us than how much by how much did they get us in goal difference? That's all I'm wondering. Nine to four. Alright, so let's we see. Lost. Okay, no, it wouldn't have made a difference. As long as we lost and then they were gonna jump us. Luckily, Coventry and all these guys brought points, so we're still in the automatic promotion all spots. Right. That'll be all for today's episode. A pretty hard, painful episode, but I guess we got the win against Oldham. Uh, I'll see you guys later, I guess. Alright, yeah, I know the audio cut out a few times, so sorry about that. That's probably just screaming too loud because I was mad, realistically. Who knows? But yeah, sorry about that. That's all I had to say. Bye. Thanks for watching.